What's up guys, it's Tom here and welcome to a brand new episode of the Real Madrid Career Mode Show and today we are playing in the Champions League against Sporting Lisbon and I'm so happy that you guys are enjoying this series. I try to upload every two or three days in this series and also the journey will return very soon. I'm just catching up on all my other Career Mode series as well and maybe in the near future I will upload some Ultimate Team videos again so let me know if you want to see that. What else do you want to see on my channel? And and I have some very special Christmas videos coming up for you guys. And also leave a like on this video if you are enjoying this Real Madrid career mode. And as you can see we have 10 points from 4 games. We have pretty much won the group. So I thought let's field the second team against Sporting. It's still a very very strong side so I expect a victory here. Let Welcome to our next Champions League game. Oh yes this is going to be a special one. Oh, oh Morata. What? Oh, Morata gets tackled and he gets an injury. Let's put Corona up front. I tried to do the fake shot and the refer defender read that pretty well. Go on, Mariano! Oh, how close is that? Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, yes. Mariano, please! What a goal! <laughs> wow, that was so close! That is a beautiful finish by Mariano. I honestly thought that I flopped it up. And yes, it's just over the line. Let's watch this again. I think it's clearly over the line, but... Yeah, there you go, guys. Oh, go on. Oh, this is... Oh, this is brilliant. Vasquez, hit it, son! Oh, he hits the post. We get another injury. This time to Coantrao. Let's bring a Marcelo for Coantrao's. Unlucky. We have six shots. They have zero. Mariano again. And Corona. There we go. It's 2 0. It's game over. This young team is bossing it in the Champions League. The first shot is blocked, but Corona, great first touch and a wonderful finish. Oh, what a pass! Unbelievable. I tried to close down the player who passed it and uh, I couldn't. And Andre Felipe got that great finish past Timo Horn and they are back in it. Oh, Benzema! Benzema! Are you kidding me? I hit the bar, I hit the post again, I hit the post twice. Let's try and win the game, so I'm bringing on uh, Gareth Bale. Oh, Bale. Oh, Bale. Oh, that is beautiful and that is shocking finish. Go on, Bale. Yes, Bale. Oh, that's brilliant! And Vasquez! Great cross by Bale, and look at Vasquez! Beautiful cross, great header, 3-1. This is a fabulous victory in the Champions League, we won the group, played with the second team, and we still outplayed and dominated Sporting. And some of the fringe players, like uh, Corona, Mariano and Vasquez getting on the score sheet. We absolutely smashed this group in the Champions League and Dortmund are already through so it's nothing to play for in the last group stage game just Sporting or Legia Warsaw deciding which team will finish uh, in third place and qualify for the Europa League. This group is the group of death. Anybody can still go through it. This is amazing. Wow. Even Leverkusen who are bottom of this group can go through in the last round. Man City already, I think they won the group, Barcelona uh, finish maybe second, but Celtic also has a chance in this one. Uh, München Gladbach doing awfully in this one and Leicester City could qualify if they, I think if they avoid losing in the last round. I really hope they, they do qualify for the next round, it would be an amazing story. Bayern and probably Atletico will go through, but PSV Eindhoven still have a, has a chance. And in this group, shockingly, Juventus are on the brink of elimination. And Napoli are also sweating in this one. Benfica and Besiktas at the moment in pole position. Benfica are already through. And Arsenal and Paris Saint-Germain are already through in this one. No surprise there. Roma 
was just in too tough a group. So these are the Champions League groups and we have some bad news. Alvaro Morata, first of all Modric, that's the good news that Modric is back from his injury, but Alvaro Morata, he doesn't have any luck with injuries. He dislocated his shoulder, he will be out for two months, eight weeks, that's almost two months, and Coantrao will be out for four weeks. And now let's smash Sporting Gijon in at home. Modric is back from his injury and I'm fielding my strongest possible lineup. Here we go! Sporting Gijon at the Bernabeu. Oh, I have an idea. Modric is available there for a long shot. Let's see. Oh, I told you! What a goal! <laughs> Look at Modric. Back with the bang and that was a clever free kick routine. And a water strike by Modric. Whoa, look at this. Just sit back and enjoy that absolute beauty by Modric. Oh, go on. Go on, Modric. Hit it. Oh, Modric could have had two. Oh, Ronaldo baited the guy. And almost scores another worldy. Go on, Gustavo. Why not? Oh. Go on, Ronaldo. Oh, Ronaldo! What a block! Sergio Ramos picked up a knock. Let's bring on Pepe. We are getting injuries. Oh no, no! What a block by Varan! No, no, no! What happened there? Isco! Go on, son! Surely! It's two! Yes, Ronaldo! Let's go! <laughs> no, that's a goal. What the? <laughs> it's offside. I was wondering what was Clay Rona was doing. I'm bringing on Corona and Benzema to give them some chances. Hopefully they can score. Another great home win. Fantastic result. To be honest, we should beat Sporting Gijon at home. Total domination, 60% possession. Let's train these young players, Mariano, Corona, Vasquez and Diaz, the youth academy player. They are improving quite nicely. I'm especially impressed with Mariano. Atletico Madrid keep on winning, so we just held that two-point advantage that we have above them. As you can see above me on the screen, Sevilla are way down. And what are Barcelona doing in 10th place? Blows my mind, even though they have a game in hand, even if they win their game, they will be only in 6th place. And this next cup game is very important against Mirandas, a small side. They finished as a 3-3 draw in the first game at the Bernabeu. So this game, it's a must-win game. We have to win this. I trust the young players. They can do the job. Corona has been scoring. Mariano has been scoring. Look at this team. Their stadium is a really small stadium. I think they are in 2nd division side, Mirandas. Oh, Benzema! It's 1-0! Yes! Benzema straight away! Somehow the ball ricocheted to him! I think I get, I get tackled and yeah, Benzema is just cool in front of goal. Go on, Mariano! Oh, the hits the bar! What a strike! Go on, Kovacic! Oh, beautiful Benzema! I can't! Oh my days! No! We hit the frame of the goal twice in this game. That is just... Go on, Mariano. Go on! No! Oh. <laughs> what? What's the defender on the, on the post? What is he doing? <laughs> that is hilarious. The defender kicks the ball. <laughs> <laughs> into his own net. I think it was already in. Oh, they opened up. Oh, they opened up. Corona! Oh, come on. Oh, go on. Oh, go on. Oh, Kovacic. Beauty! Absolutely fantastic field of play. And a great finish. That pass to Kovacic is great and a lovely finish. Let's bring on two young strikers who very rarely play. Diaz is a youth category player and Vergos is a, I think, a 
Real Madrid B player, it would have been unacceptable to go out to a second division side. And I'm really proud of this second team. They are actually playing very, very well. And this Real Madrid career world is just brilliant. I'm absolutely loving it because even though the, the second team have some really awesome, talented young players. And of course, the first team is just a dream to play with FIFA with. So I really hope that you guys are enjoying this series. Here are the results from the Spanish Cup. All the big teams are through. So Sevilla, Atletico Madrid, Barcelona. And uh, yeah, let's see who do we get. We get Sevilla in the round of 16 and Barcelona get Atletico Madrid. So basically the top four teams in the, in the Spanish league play each other in the Spanish Cup. So if we could maybe knock out Sevilla, then we would have a clear run to the final because no other team can come close to Barcelona and Real Madrid in the, in the, in the, in the strength of the opposition really so i'm really looking forward to the spanish cup adventures but that will be in the next episode really hope that you guys enjoyed this uh ram with carry with episode and also we will play dortmund in the next one so that is going to be a cracker thanks for watching leave a like if you enjoyed this see you later guys good night.